We'll be seeing Colt McCoy going in there. Texas Longhorns own legend Colt McCoy. Hook him. Hook him, Texas Longhorns. 19-13, Philadelphia leads. But we'll see what Colt McCoy, if he can get them at least closer. And then afterwards, the decision. Eddie James, who is still technically in his prime, only because he's playing by the rule book. He's consistent and steadfast. He's not being re reckless. H.T. Baum is trying to be a playmaker, but he's got messed up lower legs due to shingles. He's He just got re-signed, and we haven't seen much of Charlene Pinky Goober and Slandon Gomez. They got re-signed also. So let's See, Colt McCoy. As a kicker and for that distance, 56, 57 yards, so many things you got to worry about. But I am a little surprised he didn't get it there. Yeah, with the way kickers are now, I'm not surprised anything under 60 yards. He doesn't get it, but he still gets it. But remember this, you have to travel a little bit more. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh. They're sending an HT bomb. Colt McCoy injured his pinky or, and his throwing hand. Chucky, the puckster. And I don't quite know what's happening here. It's a first down because the team is out of the field. It's a 49-yard attempt from the left team. The good look is good. Makes the score Eagles 19, Cowboys 16. <laughs> no confidence that they can get through the red zone. Eddie James will be going back in there later. Oh, what a mess, people. What a mess. The web they are weaving in Dallas. <laughs> Take 
hallucinating on my time. keeps crossing over to the other side. Stop talking. <laughs> First down to play. First and ten at the 47-yard line. <laughs> you little snitch. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> I complained. I called. Who did you call? The officials. I told them. Jeremiah keeps crossing over. You little snitch. <laughs> You just can't let it go, can you? He can't get away with it anymore. 
somebody better tell the Cowboys defense, that's it, the gig is up, the little snitch next to me is snitching on him. Jeremiah can't get away with crossing over to the other side. It's over. Stop it. <laughs> Say something. Oh. Bobby J. If you put your thumb under your butt cheek and push it back and pull your ear, you kind of decongest your nose. What? Get. The pass protection has been a problem all night long as they come up facing second and a bundle. <laughs> Jeremiah running in and out and crossing over and risking a penalty and now oh he's got the deal of number 24 Baraki baby angel Baraki just side whacking past and boom smack down on poor Carson. He's and just like s s waving. <laughs> okay. Oh my gosh, Baraki. Who do you think you are? The President of the United States? <laughs> Somebody put him on the ticket, the presidential ticket. <laughs> He's got presidential ambitions. Oh, by the way, during Obama, Baraki secretly was part of the anti-Obamacare at the Supreme Court. Baraki was on the team that argued against mandates and penalties. So Baraki challenged Obama during President Obama's presidency concerning mandates and penalties. Baraki was saying, how many black men would fight to increase the powers of the police that they accuse of abusive police 
actions. And Baraki said, well, we have a black man in the White House who increased the powers of the IRS. Who does that? Well, so Baraki was part of the team that argued at the Supreme Court versus mandates and penalties. And the Chief Justice sided with Obama. And Baraki cussed out the Chief Justice. Called him a punk-ass little bitch. <laughs> So let's take a look at Baraki one more time. This is the one who argued at the Supreme Court versus Obamacare, mandates and penalties, and he called the Chief Justice a punk-ass little bitch. Oh, wow. <laughs> There he is, waving. Hello, Chief Justice. <laughs> Remember me, <laughs> you punk ass little bitch. <laughs> Here's Chief Elliot on the field. Did you see that? Uh, Jeremiah did it again. What are you talking about? Look. And this time they didn't... Look, both of them. Look, he got him. And they didn't call him on that. No. You don't see me. He's a ghost. Yeah. <laughs> Well, usually they do see him because they got a little snitch like you calling the officials. But this time they they let it slide. Oh my god. I'm disappointed. In this case a field goal will take it way better than the alternative, which is a pilot. But you met fan bases that want to get the real happy with that field goal. Thank <laughs> you. 
Bobby J, will you quit yelling? I'm sorry, but I cannot get over the fact of what's going on with Jeremiah crossing over and getting away with, with what anybody else will be penalized. Okay, you stated it. Now stop yelling in the background. <laughs> craziness again. Oh my gosh. First you got Bobby J back here screaming. <laughs> well Jeremiah did it again. What did he do? He kept crossing over. <laughs> I know I saw him. Everybody saw Jeremiah. I got Jericho. I mean Everybody saw him. And, like, and there goes Jericho. First of all. There goes Jabba Jabba. Job. Baby angel Jabba Jabba. On. And oh wow. He's like. Hey. What's that? <laughs> what is that? That's uh. That is Randy. Randy saying, hey, 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 what is that? <laughs> that is a football, Randy. That is a football. <laughs> Not a figment of your imagination. And here comes Jericho. Picks up the ball. And he's off to the races. And it's going to be a, no, no, it's going to be a touchdown. No, he's deciding he's taking this long scenic road. <laughs> he's deciding, he's taunting the Eagles. Oh my gosh, Jericho is not only, he's taunting them. 
thank goodness he didn't stop and turn around and say, hey, one more step, touchdown. Yes, sir, look at him. Digging the grave of the Eagles. Jericho has got a bad attitude. He's got an attitude problem. If it was that TV show Beyond Scared Straight, Jericho would be the one yelling at the inmates. <laughs> and the inmates would be like crying all over the place. <laughs> goes to the well too much. He's oh my gosh. Especially if you got Bobby J on the phone right now to the officials. Oh, my God. 
22 seconds left. Oh my God, they're sending an HD bomb. <laughs> the broken down quarterback who has the potential of greatness. It's just that he hasn't played in a while. Are you freaking kidding me? <laughs> How can A.C. Bond get a penalty? What did he do? <laughs> what did he do? Only A.C. Bond could get a penalty. I think he crossed the line. Oh, yeah. That's it. Man, look at that greatness. I tell you, oh, wide open. That's Baby Angel Jake. Oh, what a heartbreaker. Damn you, bum. Damn you to football hell. <laughs> It's for you. Who is it? AC Bond. Thank you. We welcome everyone What's he what does he want? He's saying that you see what he just did. Ah hang up on him. We'll be right back with the third half. The third half? You old geezer, you're stupid. Stupid. <laughs> 